up at your position, what do you have to do to kind of help make up for those injuries, and how do you feel the line's done in front of you? To you know, I don't really look too far into what the line is doing. I have no control over that. We just control what we can do in our group, which is the running backs. However, I can push the running backs to uh, get going, whether it's a legit, in, legit injury or, or not, which Jeff, his injury is legit. Uh, he's, trying, he's really tough. You guys know how tough Jeff is, and he's, he really wants to be with the team and, and playing out there. And, uh, it's, you can see it, this is killing him. Being uh, out of practice, and being out there with us. But, uh, you know, we're trying to get all the guys healthy and uh, have a full stable of running backs again. What's, uh, what's your opinion on Chris getting a second chance and getting to, to be back here instead of being kicked out permanently? <laughs> oh, I love Chris. If you know Chris personally, you can kind of see the whole situation in a different light, in a different perspective. Yeah, it is. You know, that, that can be a Things are taken out of context. No one knows the whole true story. Um, it was a relationship of, of three years. And everyone just thinks it's some type of uh, one night stand type deal. And so, you know, that was his personal life. And I know Chris, you know, for almost four years now. Uh, he smiles a lot. He's a great kid. We love having him around the program. He's not some guy who brings negative energy. And, uh, uh, it's just uh, rebellious the whole time. He's not that, that type of guy. So seeing Chris back, I mean, we, we love him. And, uh, you know, we're happy he's back on the team. And, you know, he's told me that he's, he's learned a lot from the situation. And he's become a, a better man. And you know, he's starting to grow up from it, he's, he's saying. And, you know, I just see it as one of those things that God had to wake him up, you know, and, uh, I feel like he's, he's really um, learned a lot from the situation. When did they tell you that he was going to be back? Uh, yeah, I think you know for the They never told me. I just, <laughs> he just popped up Sunday, uh, uh, Sunday meetings. <laughs> he was in the meetings on Sunday. Yeah, he just didn't say anything. Uh, no, not, not that I know of. You know, he, just, he has a great attitude. Right now. He was smiling. The first time I saw him, he was just sitting with his arms crossed in the hallway and just looking at me, just smiling the whole time. And he's like, I'm bad, man. <laughs> And, uh, and I was giving him a hug and stuff, but uh, it's, it's yeah, really sure. uh, you know, good to have Chris back. What was that first conversation with him like? What did you guys talk about? Uh, I just said, hey, man, you know, we missed you. We needed you for these games. And, uh, I'm just glad to have you back. We really need you.